SimCenter 3D has improved box and printing options for mapped hole mesh control. When you create a mapped hole type of mesh control, you can use the new box option in the imprint shapes list to create a map-like mesh in a square-shaped region around the selected holes. Upon the selection of the new box option, users will be exposed to new parameters such as box depth, elements through depth, lock box boundary, and extend to face boundary that will help them achieve good control over the final mesh. In this example, upon selecting the target hole, we can activate the pave layer and give appropriate values for the layer depth and number of layers parameters. This will help you create layers of paved mesh around the selected hole that can represent washer imprints. Next, for the box option, we can define the depth of the box and the number of layers of elements that will be contained within the box. If the box shape is part of your mesh design, we recommend that you use the lockbox boundary option. If you do not use this option, the mesh smoothers can smoothen the boundary of the box so that the mesh outside the box region blends with the mesh inside the box region. Lastly, the extent to face boundary checkbox controls whether the software extends the structured mesh to the boundary of the face on which the selected hole lies. This can be used to avoid tight spaces between the box and the face boundaries.